Today, the International Atomic Energy Agency sending a team of top experts amid continued missile attacks on the Zaporizhia atomic power plant, Europe's largest. The UN nuclear watchdog injecting a ray of hope, tweeting this picture of the team and writing, the day has come, support and assistance missions is now on its way. This comes as the group says shelling hit the nuclear plant itself, striking two special buildings dangerously close to the plant's reactors. All safety systems remain operational with no increase in radiation levels so far. Russia and Ukraine pointing fingers at each other for the attacks on the nuclear plant. Over the weekend, Ukrainian officials claiming Russian forces have been shelling the entire region with rockets for 14 hours, several plant workers injured, as well as two children. For months, the agency has sought access to the plant, which has been occupied by Russian forces and run by Ukrainian workers since the early days of the now more than six-month-old war. War. Ukraine accusing Russia of new rocket and artillery strikes at or near the plant, striking an apartment block. The nuclear facility has two operating reactors. Last week, they were temporarily knocked offline due to the barrage of shelling. In the northeast, Russia ramping up strikes in Kharkiv, Ukraine's second largest city. Shells falling in residential areas inside the city. The U.N. inspectors are expected to arrive later this week. Aika Jachi, ABC News, Washington.